what was I saying? What the hell was I saying? I don't know. I lost track. Oh, yeah. I think it's either this game or Kingdom Hearts that really made me, like, get back into my normal self, if you will. Because of, you know, everything going on. And as I've mentioned, uh, just in case if you were not here, the finale of uh, Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2 will be played back to back on Friday. So just in case if you're like, oh man, uh, what happened to Kingdom Hearts? Uh, the finale was never played yet. Because uh, we did God of War and then we did that. But yeah. Everything's going well though. So this Friday, uh, we'll be doing um, the finale for both games in one sitting. So probably expect Rage. Probably. Probably. I'll see what I have in the fridge. I don't I don't know if Shy Sylveon wants to come over and uh, cook me foodsies. Be like, oh, oh, I have. Oh, man. Actually, actually, just to, to just to tease everybody, just to see who wants to come over and cook me food. That's it. It's the easiest job in the world. Nah, I'm kidding. I, I could probably cook for myself. I think I have I think I have burger meat anyway. That's probably one of the best things that I've learned as an adult to cook. Cause like I've said, I, I could literally like cook the same fucking meal all over again. And it saves me money, so we'll see. I'll totally make you food. So sorry, no 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 miners in the house. <laughs> <laughs> but but you are a mod but but you are a mod so i mean no no miners i think i'm a dick with halloween i don't think i don't know if people are like afraid of me or what uh but nobody rings my doorbell like they skip my door maybe they think like nobody's home like, I, it, it must be. It must be. But, um, Halloween is coming up, which, uh, I'm, I'm interested about it. Like, I think, I, I've never really liked Halloween because I got traumatized when I was younger by a spooky, scary thing. But, um, now, I'm just like... Oh, Halloween. But, or, I've talked about this with Ori. And he's like, well, the reason why you hate it is because you've never been to a Halloween party. And I'm like, maybe this was the first time Ori's, Ori's right in, in, in his whole life with me. Because it's, it's true. It, it's so true. I've never, ever been a fan of, of Halloween. But, I, I'm really glad. I think... I think uh, the United States is like one of those states that do, like does Halloween, but a lot of other countries don't. Well, I guess I'm moving to Finland. Like how I w I was always taught told about it, right? Is if it's not a day you have off from school and work, then who gives a shit? That's ba that's basically the brunt of it. I'm gonna die here. A Halloween party in Discord? Why? You can't post selfies. Plus, no RPing, so... Very unlikely, my friend. Yeah, I get it. it it's sort of like Valentine's Day in the way of... Hey, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna spend a shitload of money... Uh, to make you feel good. Like, you don't need a day to spoil your partner. Like, I'm sorry, but you don't. I would be in a Zoom call. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I don't want to be the Debbie Downer. 
And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I know, boo. That That's what people on Halloween say. I, I really have to protect myself with selfies. Fuck a duck. Because, um... I'm n I don't I don't want selfies in here. I I I can't really risk that. Cuz I know majority of the audience is like younger and I don't want any of that. But I mean some people did ask, which is cool and all, but I'm like, yeah, no, I'm not I'm not risking that bullshit. But well, I'm I'm a Debbie Downer. That that's why I'm just moving to Finland. Just moving to film, they don't care about it. Well, that, I think that was, that was a bet as well. But, no, as I've mentioned, I think before you were here, that's why I'm terrified. I get teased or threats on, uh, on Halloween, and I'm like, I don't need it. I don't need it. But, hey... See, when you're an adult, though, you can just buy candy. Who gives a shit? Like, who, who, who literally gives a shit? You know? When you're a kid, I get it. It's fun. But when you're an adult, it's like, oh, okay. I got, I gotta buy candy for shitlings now. That'll probably ruin my garden. And I'm like, yeah. And I'm like, I don't want to deal with that. No adult wants to deal with, with kids at that age. Until you have kids, and then it's probably like one of the sweetest things ever. Because you're just like, oh man, I have kids now. You know, it's time to create some bonding experiences. And I'm like, get the fuck off my lawn! But hey. Really? That didn't hit? I, pr I, I prefer Christmas as well, because I don't, I don't get candy on Christmas. Are you guys supposed to get candy on Christmas? I sort of want the lore of certain holidays now. Now I'm curious. Because I'm just like, okay, is Easter a made-up holiday? Because I think that was the birth of Jesus Jesus Christ, and then Christmas was his birthday. Or its birthday. Uh, yeah, we're playing spooky games all through October. We're playing spooky games all through October. That is the only month that I really have to plan. That is the only month that I have to plan. And as I said, I already have two games on the uh, bought for Halloween. Halloween's the only, only, gosh darn, uh, holiday that I buy special games for. And not even my mods know it. They they haven't got gotten a list in a few months, and I'm like, oops. But. Uh, no, like, I'm not buying a costume. Like, I, I'm, I told people, like, straight out blunt. Cool, if you want to send one, awesome. But I'm definitely not buying one. Absolutely not. Kids flex what candy they got. Shit, times have definitely changed then. Because when I was a kid at candy, I didn't, I couldn't talk. Because my mouth was filled. Be like, I got a fucking ooey gooey bar. And then they're just like, that's not a bar. That's light and sticky. And I'm like, oh, I'm a child. I'm like, I am a good Christian boy. I want to say ooey gooey bars are real. But I have a feeling that's from a TV show. I want to say that's from Recess. Because I've been binge watching that. Yeah, no. Absolutely. You guys do whatever the fuck you want. You do whatever the fuck you want. 
send me whatever the fuck you want i don't care um it, it just goes to that point where ever since my second year of streaming when uh sin gamer made me how to wear the dress there have been fans that were that are just like okay yeah i'm just gonna tease you here i'm like okay at first i was very shy every every year has an era as silly as that sounds like during that point i think why i mean by era is because that was the regulars right so during that time it was the danny boy sin gamer era um and that's where i really really blushed like a lot and danny boy was just like yeah no i i i like making you blush so i'm just gonna say anything and to make you blush and then i'm like okay which is good because i developed really as a streamer on that point where i'm just like okay i can't really believe what people say um and yeah a a every year basically just has an era which is really really neat uh because i i haven't really dressed up fuck fuck um you know since high school uh senior year was the last day and literally i just i was at, uh i was gambit from um i was a mixture of gambit and some other character that i can't recall but i had a fedora i had the queen of hearts uh on my fedora and then i got a teacher in trouble and i will never forget that day because it was awesome so I fucking hated that. I I, 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 she wasn't a teacher. She was the principal's assistant, and I got her in trouble, and it felt good because she was an asshole. All right, see ya. I'll see you when I see you. Now nah, we're just gonna be chilling here. Most likely, we'll see where we're at. Cause honest to God, I thought it was fucking Wednesday. I thought today was Wednesday, my dudes. So to no, you fuck. Haters gonna hate, lovers gonna love. Healthy middle. Thanks for that raid, uh, Wushy. Thank you very much. Thank you for that very, very, very nice raid. Remember, you don't love. Me. But, uh, I hope you're well. I hope you're well, bud. And I don't know if people heard that. But, uh, that is a reference with Bo Burnham. Uh, I don't really get inspired by him. I just think he's fucking smart. And, I... Oh. Oh, God. Okay. But, uh, no, we don't get raid often. But, uh, I do hope Wushy is well. But yeah, no, or you have... Every, nobody needs my permission to send me anything. You know, my information is there. Uh, my business inquiry email is there. Everything is there. You know, it just goes to a certain point where... If you want to send it, great. If not, it doesn't really affect me any. I'm still going to be sending the same amount. Spending the same amount on my P.O. box, you know, but, uh, uh, at one point people want to send me games to play and I'm like, okay. And, uh, if they did, of course I would play it and then send something back. Oh God. This sort of reminds me of Wish, uh, Rugrats a little bit. How did that not kill me? But how was your stream, bud? I need the love every day. Yeah, this is definitely Rugrats. Tommy Pickles, man. You could see that game on the docket. That's a very spooky game. Rugrats. 
I mean, to be fair, talking babies is a little terrifying. Oh. And we, I've already mentioned one Halloween game. Um, Lay actually fucking guessed it, and I hate him for that. I still want to punch him in the lip. Because I don't know how he knew it. I just, I, I just want to punch him, punch his lips. Oh, nice. What's Star Wars? Really, I have no excuse to not watch Star Wars, because I have Disney Plus now. But, I mean, Star, Star Wars, right? What, what's a Star Wars, though? What, what's the Star Wars? But, nah. We'll see. We're still doing changes, but the other change isn't coming until December. Chat, what's your favorite character of, uh, Spaceballs? <laughs> I mean, you, you guys can't even send me, uh, Star Wars DVDs because I have Disney Plus now. At one point, I was like, eh, I wonder who's gonna send me this. I never realized until very, very recently that there is a shitload of Star Wars games. Like, they started all the way on the SNES, I believe, probably earlier than that, with arcade games. I never realized uh, it was that much of a phenomena. And that, that's what I'm, like, people I know cream all over Star Wars, so I really won't mention it. But, um... I, I, I never knew. Like, Star Wars is, um on the video that i watch it's literally one of the most uh made series of uh video games which i had no idea that's that's actually pretty pretty much a culture shock all right sounds good stay out of trouble thank you for letting me know Like, sincerely. I like teasing you guys about Star Wars, but the more and more, I'm I'm a little bit shocked about how big of the fandom is sometimes. Um, wait, what? But that that's literally just being me. But, um... I, like, I, I, can't e I can't even talk shit about it because I don't even know the fucking plot. That's it. I, 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 if I knew a little bit of it, I would be like, oh man, that's that's fucking stupid or some shit. I can't even talk shit. I, I know nothing about it. I know the little green guy or alien uh, is called Yoda. Darth Vader means uh, father in German. And that's it. That's all I fucking know. That's all I... You just said the plot? It's about three dudes named Jedi's protecting the galaxy. Are you sure, though? Are you sure, though? Like, it ha like... Why, though? Why? Is the galaxy in that deep shit? That they need the protectors? Who made them? Who made them Jedi's? Who who na who was the first Jedi and why? Yo, what's up, Zach? Oh, hi. I keep on forgetting I have bombs. Okay, you're being a little bit of a of a, of a bitch now. Medium rare Asian four. I mean, yeah. But no. I'm doing alright, Zach. How, how are you? Okay. Interesting. But no, we'll, we'll see. We'll see about it. Who knows? Actually, when would, when would be the time to play a Star Wars game? Star Wars September. Boom, there you go. There's next year's fucking path. 
Boom. No, by, by next September. Oh, nice. I'm glad. Yeah, things have been going up and down. Certain things are, are still the same. I don't know why. But ups, downs, turnarounds, left, rights. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm I'm playing with motion control, so it's a little hard. It's a little hard. I mean, it's always hard, but that that's that's a different topic. It's a problem, actually. Problem. Went to the casino. They said, "What weapons under your, under your pants?" And I'm like, "I need an adult." And that's how I got a date out of it. <laughs> nice. Um, what? Oh. When that day, when I went to the casino, uh, two days ago at this point, I felt really good. I finally won at the casino. Alright, sounds good. Take your time. Oh, okay. I'm like, man. Yeah, no, things have been going up. YouTube's slowly picking up because kids are back in school. But no, things are going great. When things turn around, uh, it went really, really good. Thank you for asking. Oh yeah, the May, May 4th be with you. Man, I had heard that, that joke for fucking many, many years. May the 4th be with you. May May Splatoon be with you, Chad. May May sticky white stuff ha have a day as well. There there probably is a day for that. Every day. Oh my god, Chad. I feel like I'm not getting like I don't know if it's a disease or what, but I do have a problem. When my hands shake a lot, fuck off. And my my hands are shaking right now. I want to say it's low blood sugar, because that runs in the family. But I I've never gotten that tested. And I think that's probably why I turned it off. Because if if you guys are saying like probably like two hours in the stream, my hands are shaking right now. But let me know. Let me know if that's a disease or something I should worry about. Or maybe it's the game. It, it's definitely not the game, but still. It's a concerning factor. It's a, it's a concerning factor, if you will. Not really. Nothing on what I've... Eh. Nothing on what I've done. A lot of, a lot of people always say, um... Like, when I was a government solderer, they're just like, man, you're just stressed. I'm like, okay, why isn't anybody else stressing out then? The deadline's in a week. You're telling me I'm the only one fucking stressing? No, but everybody else drinks. I'm like, oh. Well, that makes me feel great. Oh, it's honestly just Star Wars Day? Interesting. I'm surprised the creator of Star Wars doesn't have his birthday as a fucking holiday. Somebody's gonna be like, oh man, he actually does. I'm like, God damn it. Alright. I'll dedicate this to you, Zach. But hey, at least I'm giving this a fair shot. I'm gonna be, I, I said to myself, hey, if we're gonna start all over, then we're gonna do this right. We're gonna do this right, chat. 
Where is the other shitling? Chad, this is just like multiplayer. Come on now. But now, nah, how's everybody doing today? Uh, we're about two hours in the stream. Most likely, as I've said, uh, we're probably going to finish this world. And then probably end the stream and then tomorrow's the late day. But no, the music is very, very good. Yeah, no, a key's in here somewhere. Uh -huh. Oh, nice. Ooh. I got an email. Nice. Nah, it feels good. The thing about Yoshi is he definitely streams different games than me. Oh, cool. Logan got, got the gifts. Awesome. Cool, cool, cool. So everybody on the giveaway has gotten their prize. Awesome. That makes me feel great. I don't really, I don't really get worried anymore, um, with giveaways because, um, I, I've just been doing this for so long, but there definitely was a point where I'm just like, ah, I wonder when that's going to get there. And then I'm like, yeah, it's going to get there when it gets there. But no, they, everybody was so, this was probably the, one of the first giveaways that everybody was so grateful which sounds very, very weird, but everybody was super sweet. Except one dickhead that won the giveaway, and he, I, I think, I think he was just an idiot. Oh, you're streaming again? Damn, dude. Don't overwork yourself, man. But knowing you, you're probably gonna say you're streaming for fun, and I get that. There's no such thing as fun anymore for me. There's no such thing. But no. It, it's mainly probably just relaxing now. I think ever since I put the deadline on streaming, I wouldn't really think... I wouldn't really think things have changed a lot. But, um... That's for me. And if you are, if you are new... Uh, and have missed what's going on. There have... There... There's been a lot that's going on. Um... But, um... I have put a deadline on my streaming career. Uh, till December. So... Oh, okay. So, yeah, there's that. There's definitely that. No, I I've made a I made a YouTube video on what's going on, but no. Uh, I've been doing this for three years, about, and um, no, I I've I've mentioned my my reasoning on streaming what's been going on. Like I've said, certain people only come for certain games, and I understand that. But, um, I thought that having fun is why we all stream. Absolutely not. You do and you don't. It's very hard to describe. That's why I made a video about it. But I'm, I'm not really going to get into it. I mean, sh people definitely stream for other reasonings. Um, and everybody's reasonings are completely different. But I, I've been doing this for a, for a while, especially longer than most, and I've gotten to where I'm at. Uh, and I'm very, very fun about it. Uh, and I'm very, very glad to what I've accomplished, and I know a lot of people would love to have what I've had. But um, I have never altered my word, and we'll see. We'll, I, I, it, we'll just see. But uh, I, I've mentioned about it through last month, and that's probably where it hit me a lot. But, um, 
Yeah. You know. It's nothing bad or anything, but putting putting a deadline is probably for the best for me. I bet you could massive skip this level for sure. Unless if I miss something. Nope. Yeah, I mean... I wouldn't really say, like, I'm a beginner streamer anymore. And, you know, I, I've been through a lot of phases and I'm just like... I'm not saying I'm better than anybody else by any means. But my mental state is just like, okay. You know, I, I'm... I'm at three, almost 3,000 followers, which is really good. And my analytics are fine, but they're just not where I want them to be. And that's it. That's it. And I never want to really have the feeling like, am I just wasting my time with this? But, I mean, it, it is. It, it's, it's one of those things where, of course, I make people happy. But, um... And ever since I came back from my break, my first ever break of streaming, uh, I've definitely been doing well. But my mental state is just different than everybody else's. Nobody will really understand pain. No, I don't I don't need time. I like I've said, I'm not getting in this discussion with anybody because I've talked about it a lot and I'm not gonna repeat myself. It's one of my pet peeves. But if you don't care on what you do or or anything then why the fuck are you here but i mean li like i said i my mental state's different and i i've i've done a very big detailed video no nah, i'm not n unfortunately at this standpoint i'm not gonna believe that uh i i'm not gonna say everybody's here for me because they say they are and they're not and then i'm like okay great i got lo let down again so, I mean, I'm very real, and like I've said, this was probably, like, the two, three months that I've realized, like, certain people are gonna be like, yeah, okay, they're here for you. But, I, I, no, exactly, you're one of those people where I know. But, it's very hard, because if you don't really have people say they're here for you, right, then you really haven't made it, like, you don't really need followers to have a great community. You, you don't. And, you know, like I've said, that's what makes me unique. Where, you know, I, I'm not a beginner streamer. I have streamed for a very long time. And I have a community. Not a lot of people have that community. But, um, it just goes to that factor on... Some people have regulars. Some people don't. But, um, a community is very, very stressful to do it alone. And then with me, build trust and everything. And then some people get that trust and some don't. And, and yeah, it, it's hard to do shit alone. But, like I've said, it's probably just stress. Like, sincerely. I haven't, I never had a day off, um, of streaming, um, until last week. And I just, I, and it's not really pacing, because, you know, like I've said, I, I made a Twitch video as well, where if you're over-streaming, which I, I haven't done in a very long time, but if you over-streaming, you're never letting people crave you, and that's what you need in the world of streaming. Like, if, pe if, pe if you stream every day, right, they're gonna say, why the fuck, why, like, why do I have to watch you now? You stream every day. Like, I'm not going to miss much in a day. And then, you know, I get these people questioning me. Be like, oh, wow, your advice really helped. I'm like, yeah. It's analytics. And then you got the people that, hey, I just want to stream for fun. And I'm like, oh, okay, cool. But most of those people stop within two years of streaming. And um, it, it's just your mindset. It's your mindset with age and then maturity level. Um, why do I say maturity level? It really, you could be immature and mature at the same time. But if you really don't have that thrive to grow bigger, then it doesn't really affect you. Like, who, who gives a shit, basically? 
But, I mean, it's just hard effort and time, and that's what I've put in. And, and uh, it is what it is. You know, I never think of starting all over, but I'm just like, hmm. What if this all stopped tomorrow? That That's, that's my mindset sometimes. I'm like, meh. Not anymore since I've come back and I've I've been doing this a lot better. And I don't really tell, I, I don't need people to tell me, oh man, I'm doing a good job because I, I know I'm good at doing a good job. Um, and it's dickish, but you don't really need to be told that you're cool, nice, or anything. But, I mean, yeah, I exactly. But, I mean, like I've said, I'm not going to offend the 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 younger streamer that's just putting their foot out there that's why i say in my opinion but every everybody has different virtues and thoughts and everything but um i know what i have to do it's just unfortunately um doing it if that makes sense but c certain things are definitely going to change by the first uh january if i do still stri start streaming because i mean odds are absolutely i'll still be here like odds are like absolutely. fucking -lutely. so that that's good for like the people are worried like there's a 10 percent chance that i'm i'm pooped but by january i'm not gonna say i'm gonna be changing as a person but some things are definitely going to be changing so, I mean, very, very minute things. Oh, so I completely missed that, honestly. You know, it, it's, you know, some people are going to be like, Joe, I understand. I don't really need people to understand. Like I said, that's sort of a dickish move as well. But I'm one of those people where nobody is going to change my opinion on something. Your opinions matter wholeheartedly, but they really, they only change on certain things like games that I play and everything. They don't really change my outlook. Only certain people change my outlook on, on things. Very, very slim people though. But as I've said, it's, it, it's the trust effort, if you will. And if people haven't earned my trust, like no, like a guy or a gal is going to be, nobody's going to be like, okay, yeah, do this. I'm going to be like, oh, man, I never thought about that. I like when people open my mind with certain things. Uh, but, I mean, like I said, I could definitely be a dick in some ways. But I don't count it as being a dick. It's just my mind. Cool. Where are you going to go now, buckaroo? That was cool. But, um... You know, I, I have inspirations, and like I've said, they got in there in many, many years, but I'm me. I, I have inspirations, but I hate when people say, oh, you're going to be the next this, you're going to be the next that. I'm not the next of anything. I'm the first goddamn Joe Wilde. Obviously, if that's my time. If, if, if that is my name when, when I do that. But, I mean, that's, that's my number one rule as well, where... Never compare me to anybody else. Never. It, it's it's flattering in a lot of ways, and and I get that a lot of people take it as flattery, because mockery is the best form of flirting. Uh, but nah, in dating, um, in life, and I'm like, no, you, you can't compare two different people. Be like, but you're very similar in a way. I'm like, that's cool. So you could say you're very similar. But, now, uh, like I said, it's my mindset. And, you know, some people just aren't like me. And, god damn, if there, was, if there was more people like me, I think I would probably have to end my life. I think the world could only handle my mindset. <laughs> and I guess, you know, this is a platform that I could, like literally like um explore it i mean obviously hopefully in the future maybe next year i will have a co-host uh or co-hostist or finally have my podcast um 
but as of right now, I really, really don't have that vibe with somebody. And, uh, you know, th I think that's probably, for example, for example, you know, they are one of the newest people in the community, but, um, you know, Shy Sylveon is one of those people that literally could fucking raise their voice, uh, or make their voices be heard, and a lot of people just listen, and, you know, I respect that. I, I, I truly, truly respect that, because, you know, some people are shy, some people just are... Some people like to talk like myself. And, you know, you gotta be like, okay, am I, am I gonna piss this guy off? And nobody can really piss me off unless if they're bullying. But, uh... Yeah, you know, I, I love when people voice their opinions, and it and it's very easy to let my mind run when I'm feeling confident. Be like, w Joe, what do you mean by that? Because, well, obviously I'm playing a game, right? I want to show some effort. At, like, it's not that I don't care, it's just, okay, I don't have to be good, but I, I need to have the basic concept on knowing what the fuck I'm doing. And with this game, for example, you know, I'm like, oh, okay, I, I, I know what I'm doing now. You know, let's, let's talk about it. But, I mean, I, I, I've mentioned this and a lot of people, a lot of beginner streamers are just like, man, I have to be good at this game, so blah, blah, blah. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, people watch me because I'm good. People don't give a shit about the game 80% of the time. People give a shit about who you are, why you're doing this, why, why you're a streamer, and that's basically it. You don't have to be good at the game, you just have to have a mental standpoint. Be like, I have to play so-and-so because it's competitive. Why? Why? Nobody told you to play it. You're just assuming on what people want. But that's the, that's the other saturated point. But, no, I mean, like I said, I, I definitely do have fun because I get to relive certain games and everything. But it, it just goes to the factor on sometimes fun isn't enough and you just need a break and then fun mixed with stress and that's it. I feel like I'm, oh, speaking of me doing good at the game, I feel like I'm blowing through this game. So the first world took me 30 minutes. This world took me 40. Did I add correctly, chat? No, I didn't. We did three worlds, yeah? 30, 40, and then whatever this one is. Because we're at two, two, uh, two hours. I feel like I'm blowing past this game. Jesus Christ. Maybe if everybody's good, I'll do four worlds. M maybe. Because I did say I'm ending it here. But yesterday was a short stream. I'm like, I don't really want a short stream on a game that I love. Yeah, that's very weird. But, I mean, that's that's me doing good at a game. I'm like, hey, I, I shut my mouth uh, to get good at a game, and that's it. Oh, uh, is there only five sections to this game? Hold up, really? Hold on. If somebody can confirm or deny that... Let me know. Ah, oh, shit. Cause I would, I would be a little shocked by that. I, I is if there's only five worlds, maybe we, we will just beat this first story mode today. That, I think that would be a nice treat for everybody. Shit, it would be a nice treat for me. <laughs> I have plenty of water. It's only four here, so I'm like, oh. But we'll see. We'll see. But Zach, how's streaming for you? And, uh, welcome Nin Fanny 69 That's, that's not Fanny. Nin Phantom, uh, 69 yeah, you had to add that 69 and welcome late. Yeah, the person that I'm gonna punch after the stream for spoiling a Halloween game.
And the only reason why I mentioned those two is, um, or those few people are, uh, because they were lurking. I gotta show my lurkers some love. Definitely. Definitely, definitely. And I bought a new sweet coat. Nice. How could this happen to me? Oh my god. Oh. Do I have to... Ow. Holy hell. That actually hurt a lot. Damn, I wouldn't say this boss is difficult. I bought a new sweet coat. Only in Japan. Only in Japan, Chad. I do feel like this game is pretty easy, though. Definitely, definitely, wholeheartedly. I hope more Switch games gets gets recommended. Oh, okay, Shadow Clones. Uh, apparently. It's, a, it's actually, it's actually doing a pretty good way of doing it. I died. Oh, I'm not dead. Oh, all right. Music's really nice. That's it, ink him up. Oh, thanks, Marie. Giving me useless information again. She's so good to me. I feel like this boss comes back because I, or this boss was in Splatoon 1 because I remember seeing this boss twice uh, in the Splatoon DLC. Yeah, we'll see where I'm at. Oh. <laughs> Don't worry, nobody saw that. Don't worry. Yeah, I feel like I'm blazing through this boss. Or this game, if you will. Agent 4, I want to thank you again for all you've done so far. I think it's time I told you about my other prop uh, uh, purpose in this asking for help. When we met, I told you that the great zapfish is gone, but I'm afraid that's not the whole story. You see, even more than the great zapfish, I want to find my cousin Callie. Uh, she vanished on the same day the great zapfish. Wait, you already knew. Phew, cool. And I do like how they reference Agent 3, because I'm assuming that was the agent in Splatoon 1. Yeah, and I've never gotten confirmation if it is level 5 or not. But yeah, we're only two hours in, and we're going pretty fast. Uh, so let me pause one more time. Because that's section 4. I think there's only five sections to this game. To... Yeah, we'll see. I, I guess we'll just finish the story mode. I mean, that was my mini goal for tomorrow. Or get this game done by tomorrow. Because I want to do the Octoling DLC. Because like I said, I have a very hard goal in this game. Because don't forget, we're only playing this game for a month. And I have to get level 30 on multiplayer. And that's really, really hard to do. Why level 30? Because on what I was told, that unlocks every weapon and everything. 